Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. Last we left off, we were in the middle of a fight. Aren't we always? engaged. <laughs> scare me you don't come ah you wait until I come in to come you fucker you fucker this is dumb but I'm doing it anyway Keep looking around just in case there's, say, something like that hanging about. So, I've mentioned before how my skills when it comes to, uh, there was something else. I swore. Huh. Anyway, uh, my combat skills leave a lot to be desired, I'm sure. Okay. All right. All right, two ways up to the same place. Guys, okay, you're on this side of the door.
production line shut down, huh? Joy! We all know how much I love these! And... There we go. <clears throat> Making our way out of here. Def deactivated all infected mechs. All of this because we decided to go checking on every planet that we saw. Oh, got so many people dead. All because these people were not checking their numbers fast enough. What? No, no notice of unread messages? Oh. I guess I never checked that one as read. How may I help you, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. And she means it. Alright, so once again, taking a moment to uh, make sure the fishies are fed. Make sure our deficies are not deficient in nutrition. I'm so sorry for that. Okay. And, well, let's see. We've had a couple of missions now. Done a lot of searching and such. Maybe Grunt has something extra to say now. Do-do-do-do. Sup, Grunt? Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo. Then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships, anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info's floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarians, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. That's... That's a good pun. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak, pitiful. So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Well, actually, your reaction is pretty Krogan of you. <sighs> and don't worry. You'll prove it soon enough. Anything going on over here? The new armor reinforcements really threw off the gravimetric profiles. But engines are good to go. I rebalanced the Gilborn coefficients and adjusted the anterior intakes on the second tier stabilizers. I love it when you talk dirty. <laughs> Damn, you two. All right. I 
don't think much will have changed in the crew quarters. <clears throat> if an enemy crow can get close to you, they'll charge. You don't want that. Generally speaking, you don't. A charging Krogan... Well, it hurts. A lot. The commander has put together an impressive team. I've never worked with so many aliens before. They're a small army. We might just pull this mission off. Huh. Just wait until you see we, what we've got in store. So, what about you, Garrus? Shepard. Need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. No. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is so fascinating immediately to the left on the floor? Sheesh, Clara. This game has some very interesting tendencies. Alright. So I'm... I would chat with Miranda, but I don't think she has anything new to say just yet. So, we've taken care of a lot. One of the things that we're actually, well, before I move on much further, just to bore you guys a little bit, because outside of even that, this place was marked as having rich resources. And here you can actually see how much work I've been putting into scanning and just how much Ooh, Ezo. Launching probe. Element Zero is not a common material throughout the Launching universe. Probe. So having anytime you find a planet that has even a little bit of Ezo on it, you definitely wanna go poking around and see what you can do to get those numbers up. <clears throat> But yeah, you can see by my numbers here, this is a really fucking rich planet, jeez. They weren't lying. So, um, uh, yeah, I guess, uh, k -Pack, if you ever needed, uh, any resources, is a good place to go. Launching probe. Pro. So, and you can see why this isn't exactly a process I normally take the time to show. It's not terribly entertaining and there's really not much else that I can add, commentary-wise. I suppose I could play music. Make up my own if I felt so inclined, but... I don't know, I don't feel like putting... Whoa, that was a big spike. Uh, and where's... Where's the top end of this spike? There it is. Launching probe. And only now does it switch to moderate. So you can keep hunting for even smaller little packs, little spikes here, but I think we're pretty much done here. Okay. So there's one more recruitment mission that we have to worry about. Uh Rather than get started with that, I'm just gonna go check out Omega. Check out their markets and everything. Yes. Pretty, but no. I'm not gonna waste your time with more cutscenes. Besides which, you've already seen it, and if you haven't, well, it's recorded, so you can go back and check out the video that has it. Now I say I'm not going to waste your time with this, but it turns out, it could turn out very easily that what I'm looking for is not here. Alright, so, uh, just for funsies, let's take the two people that we recruited from this station with us. Okay. By the quarantine reports. The plague has been completely eradicated, Shepard. Nice. Dr. Solis's assistant has been helping any patients with complications. Excellent. Knew he could do it. Aww. He's so proud of his assistant. But yeah, it could easily turn out that I'm wasting your time here. Do, 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 do,
to do. The Memorial on a Coos is expected to open next year. Once the Earth has been safe for visitors, Admiral Stephen Hackett will be back. End. End is nigh. The end is nigh. So let's see. Parrots and Orion. Uh. Capacitator chest plate. Omni tool upgrade the hack module doubles the time limit for a hack. Uh yeah. We can use this. Yeah, exactly. We can use it. I've never been particularly good at the hacking, and having more time to work with can only really help. Galaxy is kind of a dick. Oh look, Vorcha. <laughs> How did they know I said that? Heavy skin weave? It's a good thing. Heavy a weapon, ammo. You know what? Yeah. This looks interesting. And I don't need that yet. Do, do, do. Okay. So what I was looking for here, we do not have. Oops. But I did pick up a couple of things that I think will be fairly essential, at the very least. It, it definitely can't hurt to have those things on board with us. And I went past where I was trying to go. Do I? All right. I'm glad to hear, though, however, that um, Morden's assistant is doing well. Okay, don't need the cutscene. At this point, it's just padding. So, as I was mentioning before, we have one last recruitment mission, the Convict. And it's one heck of a doozy, and it will open up another part to the game. See, this game has very clearly defined uh, sections, in a way. And uh, the way that, that it gets... Nothing new? Okay. The way that it gets handled is, it, you know, dividing it up. You can still... It's non-linear, like it doesn't have to be perfectly linear in order to accomplish everything. Um, but it has to be all done within a particular period of time. Okay, Omni Tool. Yeah, I've got enough now. And... Emergency shielding. Yes. That would be useful, thank you. Okay, so, don't need to worry anything about anything there. And she was just checking her bare hand there. <laughs> anyway, I'm out of time for this installment of Let's Play Mass Effect 2. I hope to see you next time where we tackle one of the last recruitment missions before moving on to the next part of the game. Hope to see you then!